King County prosecutors have filed first degree murder charges against a man they say is responsible for killing 19 year old Lorenzo Anderson outside of the so called CHOP or Capitol Hill organized protest zone in June. King 5's Tony Black went through the documents to find out what witnesses say really happened. Please allow us to get fire into the area to provide the name. On June 20th, Horace Lorenzo Anderson was shot and killed in Capitol Hill. He was 19. Wednesday, King County prosecutors charged Marcel Long with first-degree murder. Anderson's death happened just near the Capitol Hill occupied protest, but it is not believed to be related. Court documents cite several witnesses that describe how Long and Anderson were arguing and how surveillance video shows Long pulling out a gun and pointing it at Anderson, who quickly began running away. One witness told authorities eventually Long was standing over Anderson. That witness told police he also had a gun and began firing it in the air to distract Long and, quote, save the guy's life. The witness told authorities Long initially looked over at him before looking back at Anderson and firing. Anderson was shot four times. Stop! FPD, stop! Investigators say they relied heavily on witness accounts because of the difficulty they had investigating the crime scene when it happened. Move your cars, go! Long remains on the loose. Investigators say he left the state immediately. Once arrested, his bail will be at $2 million. Tony Black, King 5 News.